Let's be honest. Governments around the world have been a little bit slow uh, to grasp the nettle when it comes to electric vehicles and clean energy technology. But nature abhors a vacuum, and when national governments haven't taken action, it's often local organisations that start to inspire change. Perhaps it's because they are acutely aware of the cost of air pollution that some cities have led the way when it comes to reducing emissions. Cities like Shenzhen in China, who have replaced 20,000 diesel buses with 20,000 electric buses, as do bike-friendly cities like Utrecht in the Netherlands, and very recently the city of Sydney in Australia, who have recently announced they are going to be 100% renewably powered. In fact, we've covered some interesting cities in the last few years, and not least Dundee, which is seriously punching above its weight. So maybe it sounds a bit too grandiose, but we think Fully Charged should shine a light on the cities that are doing the most in the deployment of electric transportation and renewable energy. Perhaps we can inspire other cities, uh, other towns, maybe even national governments, to accelerate the transition to more sustainable technology and to create smarter, more habitable conditions for us all to live in. And for that reason, we're very excited to announce our new awards programme, Fully Charged Cities. The top cities will be featured in a special Fully Charged Cities episode later this year. The winner will be announced at our Fully Charged Together industry event on the 30th of October and will be the first inductee into the Fully Charged Cities Hall of Fame. They will also benefit from being the sole subject of a special episode of Fully Charged, and the 2021 winner will be announced in the city that wins in 2020. We've assembled a crack committee of judges, including Christina Boo, Michael Liebrich, Dr. Helen Chersky, Lucas Neckerman, Emma Pinchbeck, and Ketan Joshi. I'm just in the chair. I'm not going to decide anything. So that is an amazing lineup of people who really know the situation with cities, with electric transport, with renewable energy. Amazing lineup of judges. Now the deadline is the 18th of September 2020. And while we would love to hear general suggestions of which cities should be nominated, this first year that we're doing, we really want the cities themselves, so the people at the city councils or the city offices, to nominate their city for the first round of the Fully Charged Cities competition. Details of how to receive a nomination pack can be found beneath this video. And don't forget, in 2021, we will be hosting more Fully Charged live events than ever before. So that's all, Fully Charged Cities. I think it's a really, really good initiative. I'm really excited about what we're gonna achieve with this. Anyway, that's all. As always, if you have been, thank you for watching.